All right, everybody. Happy Sunday night. Welcome to Music on the Menu on the River. Alan K. Stout with you as I always am. Sunday nights, 9 to 10 o'clock, playing your regional artists, doing their own original material from right here in northeastern Pennsylvania. Hanging out with D.C. Taylor. D.C., how are you, my friend? Good, Alan. How are you doing? Good. Getting ready for uh, Thanksgiving coming up this week. Hope, oh, you, yeah. hope you have a good one. Uh, yeah, definitely. You too. Thank you very much. And we have a guest here in the studio tonight. Uh, Mr. Brett Alexander is here. Probably have been about a year since you've been here, Brett, I think. Yeah, at least a year. Yeah, I mean, been a while. you played with uh, Gentleman East at, um, at Breakers. At Breakers, and, yep. And I think that may have been the last time that you were here. So good to see you again. Happy to be here. And the reason that we have you here uh, tonight is because you have been working on a couple of real interesting projects. And we played some of them here on the show going back to maybe springtime, the Tom Flannery project. Mm -hmm. And then just last Sunday, for the first time, we premiered a couple of tracks from a project that you did uh, with an artist named Jeff Lehman. Yes. And, um, you know, you got all that going on. You've got Saturation Acres. You're always producing new bands, you know. Um, you know, obviously the stuff you did with the Badly. So we just thought we'd have you in and, and kind of talk about what you've been up to and, and maybe feature this new project that you did with Jeff. Can you tell us great. a little bit about this record? Um, he's from... York, actually. Uh, yeah, York, Harrisburg, down that, yeah. that area, Carlisle. Mm -hmm. How do you find you? Um, actually, uh, um, through a mutual friend, a uh, friend of mine, Jeff, uh, that I went to high school with. Okay. Believe it or not. All right. Uh, and they're, they're buddies down there. And um, I mean, obviously, the Badly is well known throughout yeah, he, Harrisburg yeah, and York, and, too. And, and, you know, I, yeah, I assume, I assume Jeff knew about the Badleys before that. Right. You know, but that was, that was where we, we got to be friends and... You know, talk about music and do some work together. And the album, um, you sing the songs. Mm -hmm. Jeff co-wrote the songs. Well, well, what happened? Like Jeff and I have been collaborating on songs for quite a few year, quite a few years. Um, but uh, he used to have another songwriter that he worked with, and eventually, he kind of like Jeff writes music, but not you typically lyrics. He's written lyrics on some of these, but okay. You know, his stock and trade is writing music. Okay. So then he said at, at one point he said, you know, you got any like lyrics laying around. <laughs> <You know? laughs> and, uh, and, and I had just, uh, you know, I'm always stockpiling things and I'm like, well, you know, I had things, you know, I have stuff and I have tunes that I've written that I, I doubt that I'm going to use that I didn't like, or I was, you know, half finished or whatever, mm -hmm. wherever, whatever state of repair they were in. Right. And so I just started, I mean, literally a pen pal record almost, you know, it just kind of started emailing him. And setting those lyrics to his music. And then well, I just started emailing him lyrics. Okay. And then he would, you know, over, over time, send back one or two. Oh, he'd set the music to the lyrics. Yeah. Okay. And okay. then I would, then I'd say, okay, well, there's that. And then I would, you know, add my two cents to it and build a band around it. Wow. And, and uh, we never, I mean, towards the end, we did a couple of tracks, but for the most part, we never sat in the same room together. Okay. Isn't that the, you know, that's probably common these days. Oh, with, very much so. technology, sound, yeah. sound yeah. Share, file sharing, and so forth. Yep, that's the way. Well, let's play, we're going to play a bunch of tracks from this record. We played a couple last week. We're going to play those again, and we're also going to premiere a few more, as well as some of the stuff that you had done with Tom Flannery this year and some of your work with your former group, The Badleys, and your current group, Gentleman East. So it's a lot of Brett Alexander here tonight on Music on the Menu. This one's called Mr. Learn It the Hard Way. Check it out. You bought a pair of loaded dice. You eat your words with bad advice. You traded all your men for mice. Look at me for answers that you already know Draw the bulls out round the arrow Hoping everyone eats crow What else am I gonna say? Mr. Learn it the hard way Mr. Learn it the hard way Saw the emperor's new clothes You said I gotta get me a pair of those You already know the way that that goes mm -hmm. You were 
betting on eternal news and you went all in now you're crying on her doorstep confessing all your sins what the hell she gonna say miss learning the hard way mr learning Your words with bad advice You traded all your men for mice mm -hmm. And you look at me for answers That you already know Draw the bullseye round the arrow Hoping everyone eats crow What else am I gonna say? Mr. Learn it the hard way Mr. Learn it the hard way Mr. Learn it the hard way Ain't nobody who 
watching over you every time, every time it happens. But don't you have the trust the way you feel? Why you gotta reinvent the wheel every time? here on Music on the Menu on the River, a song called True. That one goes back right to 2004 from the Gentleman yep. East record. Uh, mm -hmm. What a great record that was, too. We still play I still album. play a lot of that, yeah. that material live, yeah. That was, that was a fine album. Before that, brand new material from Brett, which he did with an artist from um, the Harrisburg, York area, Jeff Lehman, a song called Mr. Learn It the Hard Way. And we're talking about that record that you did with Jeff, kind of spotlighting it here tonight. Has... Since you left the the Badleys uh, oh, two and a half years ago now, I guess it is, um, and since you've been involved with Saturation Acres for 14 years now, 15 almost? Uh, 1999, yeah. so yeah. that's more than that. 17, 17 years, years. Wow. Um, Have you, I don't remember, I've known you for a long time, I've known you for you know, almost 25 years, collaboration like this, you know, you doing albums with, with other guys, you know, is mm -hmm. that, that's still kind of a new thing? For you, or have you been doing it but just not releasing them? Because you put out two of them this year. Yeah, I mean, I have I have two other ones that I'm working on right now with with different people. Um, eh, you know, like I mean, like the Farley record wasn't. I mean, that wasn't a total. You know, like a duo. Right. But I mean, like a lot of the songs on some of his solo Tim Farley stuff, I co-wrote. You co-wrote. We, we worked that out together. Right. right. You know, we wrote as a producer. I would expect that sometimes from you yeah but i but this this year we've actually seen the slash on the album cover yeah to, you know the yeah you know. i mean I've, I've I've done a lot of co-writing with people and you know and, and co-wrote songs on their albums and things but uh i guess these ones are a little bit like you say i'm actually have my name on them i did it with eddie randazzo for eddie's first record oh that's right yeah that's you know, right it's usually a lot mm -hmm. of the you know, eddie uh eddie doesn't play an instrument you know he writes his lyrics and no. has a song in his head and he just comes in and starts humming the song right. <laughs> and then you just kind of turn it into turn it into something so yeah yeah well actually i've done that with you a couple of times yeah. when i think about right, it right yeah. yeah yeah so i mean i do it a lot i mean it's like i mean you know every i mean it's just kind of like a like a day gig you know i mean it's like every day you're in there doing something with someone what do you enjoy about working with another songwriter well i mean the the good thing about doing that is i mean like i said i mean when you when you're kind of just working on your own all the time and you're like a singer songwriter and you're it, it just gets 
you know, you can only talk to yourself. <laughs> you, <laughs> like, it's nice to get into a room with somebody that doesn't approach things the way you approach it. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, that was one of the cool things about working, doing this record with Jeff was I had all these lyrics and I had tried my hand at writing music for all these songs. Like there was, you know, right. ideas and like I said, in various states of repair or finished or not finished. And it was interesting to send them off, you know, with whatever my idea was in my head that I thought that I had. They taken, might be, yeah. That I, whatever I'd, I had tried and mm -hmm. maybe unsuccessfully tried, sent them to him. And then they would, sometimes they would come back a complete 180. Oh, yeah. Like it wouldn't be anything at all like what I was trying to do when I just did it myself. And then sometimes they'd come back very, very similar. It would be kind of creepy. I mean, oh, that would be a song that maybe you thought would be softer and it came back harder oh, yeah. and, and things yeah. like that. Always. That's pretty cool. So, yeah. So, that, I mean, that's kind of neat. It just kind of... So, in, in a way, I mean, that was... You know, you're just kind of like repurposing music in a way. Yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's play another one from this record from uh, Brad Alexander and Jeff Lehman. This one's called Fool Me Twice. What have you done? You made a fool of everyone. The earth, it still revolves around the sun, but nothing ever changes. Now, how many times must you fool me twice? For I realize that I'm wrong Lay it out on paper, it all seems nice But we're gone, gone, gone Gone, gone I can see in your face Still we we Open our case Thinking there must be evidence We missed along the way But nothing ever changes so how many times must you fool me twice Before I realize that I'm wrong Then we spend our time just being nice But it's gone, gone, gone Gone, gone Gone And time keeps running As time keeps on running away Same circles you and I And you can say we never tried But we've been around this from all sides But nothing ever changes No, nothing ever changes So how many times must you fool me twice Before I realize we're wrong Lay it out on paper it all seems nice, but we're gone, gone, gone. Oh, how many times must you fool me twice before I realize we're wrong? Lay it out on paper, it 
it all seems nice But we're gone, gone, gone Gone, gone Gone, gone Please hear our music on the menu on the river, a song called Nothing Like the Real Thing. And before that, Fool Me Twice from Brett Alexander and Jeff Lehman. Uh, that song from the Badleys, I guess, will probably wind up being the last Badleys record um, with you on it. Um, mm-hmm. if, you, if you don't count the soundtrack that came out with for the movie recently. Yeah, it was on the soundtrack that you came know, out. You're on that, too. But the last new Studio release album. of new material. Yep. 
and that whole second side of that record disc two was was you yeah we love that song here on the show yep. um getting back to the brent alexander uh jeff lehman album now you were explaining throughout the show you wrote the lyrics jeff writes the songs you send him the songs the lyrics he sends you back basically was it, was it demos did he then sing them and yeah like guitar vocal demos usually so okay. maybe 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 a couple other things you know okay but uh just kind of sketches yeah okay mm -hmm. so what an interesting creative process yeah. yeah and then sometimes you know the way it was laid out if i wanted if i heard something else i'd you know change something with mm -hmm. the music or whatever stretch a lyric out or whatever needed to be done it was just like a chain letter and you've got about, uh, there's a couple bonus tracks on the record, and so mm -hmm. I think it's about 12, 13 songs on yeah, this record. I think, so, yeah, yeah, I think it's... Is this a time-consuming project? Um, well, yes and no. Um, some of it was done, well, there's a couple tracks on there, like I think you're going to play later, the My Side of the Story. Mm -hmm. That's one of two... That's one's coming up now. Yeah, that's, that's one of two songs on the record that I actually didn't write. That's actually Jeff and another co-writer, okay. Alan. His name is Alan. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, he, and they they wrote this uh, wrote that song, and that that song is from several years ago. So we've been collaborating for a long time, okay. but, but within the last probably two three years, we've kind of in earnest been you know consistently. We always have one in the till. You know, there's like if you know I, I can't, I'll send him a lyric and he'll be working on it and. I'll be working on the music. This is a great track that we're going to play right now, and you sound great on it. Was it fun for you just to sing a song that you didn't write the lyrics for or have you know that yeah. much to do with musically? Well, there's many, many others like that mm -hmm. one. You know, there's a there's a catalog of songs of that ilk that Alan and Jeff wrote that you know, from years back, probably you know five, six, seven years back, mm -hmm. uh, that that I didn't cherry pick for the uh, for the Alexander Lehman record. Okay. Um, as well as other songs that Jeff and I collaborated on. So, you know, there's like a hard drive full of stuff. Yeah. But so, do you yeah. enjoy it? Oh, I love it. Yeah, I mean, I, I love that song in particular, and I always wanted to put it out on something. It sounds like a song you would like. You it, know, yeah, song. yeah, I mean, yeah. it sounds like something, yeah. I didn't, I didn't realize you didn't, you didn't co-write it. You know? I, don't think, so. I don't think lined up with everything else. I think it, it sounds like... I could have. Yeah, you know? exactly. I guess that's what I'm trying <laughs> to say. Sounds like the style. Yeah, you know? it does. It does. All right, let's play it. This one's my For, side of the story. Jeff, uh, Jeff Lehman, Brett Alexander. She said I'm not the one I said to everyone just left her undone Cause she Found a new way now And it's not With this one Think I still have a reason for hanging around How can you lose when you live in love town my song to her has the right words now That she won't turn me down The girl won't turn me down, no So it's my side of the story If you even care how I feel Thought I'd let her lead the way Brought me to her dream A place I'd like to stay So she could run With the wind there Steal back the time Lost before today But then the wind Just made Cast kind of control. Follow me out till she saw the fences. Would you really let me go? Would you really let me go? My side of a story. If you even. 
talking to myself Think about once a day Then put back on the shelf Cause she left me when we were young And I never got over her very well Yeah, yeah, yeah If I make my way Outside tonight Say goodbye to remember when Find the one that's out there Waiting for me My side of our story If you even care how I feel My side of our story Is the song
Gentlemen East here on Music on the Menu on the River with a song called Unbreakable. And before that, Brett Alexander and Jeff Lehman with a song called My Side of the Story. Of course, Gentlemen East, a band that features Brett Alexander and uh, Aaron Fink, Paul Smith, Ron Samosik. Mm-hmm. Um, so three of the three of the Valley's guys and Aaron, formerly from Breaking Benjamin. That record's about a year and a half old now or so, maybe two. I don't know, is that two years old? Almost, wow. Yeah, I think so. Wow, that's, that's you know, unbelievable. It got anything going on with that band? I know you still gig sometimes. Yeah, we've been doing a few gigs, and we're talking about some recording in the spring. All right. Yeah. Something to look forward to. This project now that we're going to play a couple tunes is another one of those records that Brett had been a part of. This was released a little earlier in the year, I think maybe springtime, and it um, it's with Tom Flannery, a, a really talented guy from grew up at Lackawanna County, Scranton Way, mm-hmm. um, who has written some plays. Uh, you know, did, he's been a guest on our show. You know, He actually did some work with the late Jason Miller. Yeah, he did a uh, playwright. Yeah, yeah and um, he worked with you on this record. What was it like to work with Tom on this sort of uh, co- collaborative record? Well, you know, I, I knew of Tom. I mean, I, we'd met before, but mm-hmm. never, never made any music together. I always respected what he did. I mean, obviously, but... Uh, yeah, it was like really, really uh, nothing. I can. It was fast, you know. We hit it off. We're both the same age. We both have two daughters. We both <laughs> think the same, you know. Yeah. Uh, like men, we're just a, like kind of the same spirit. Yeah. As people, you know, and uh, and it took off really fast. Uh, doing tracks with him, and he likes to work really, really fast. He told he told me I did a story about him for the. Uh electric city around the time the record came out and he talked about how you know he would like you know that the track's done you know basically right yeah like i'm still learning the chords and he's like oh, that's it you know? <laughs> but uh i don't know which, which songs are, are you are you gonna play? we're gonna play uh we're gonna play got to be the change which is one that uh, tom sings and then i uh, feel like an orphan train which is one that i love that sing. feel like an orphan orphan train song yeah. um, i love them both but that one was neat because it was, he had he said that was in reverse to the Lehman Project because Tom gave me a lyric and just said, I, I don't know what to do with this. Oh, okay. You know? You said it to me. Isn't it? Yeah, and then I had done a session and uh, the guy I did the session with was using this weird kind of open C tuning that was I'd never used before, so I'm messing around with that and start singing over top uh, of uh, his lyrics. And I, I was just really happy with that one. I think that one, I, I'd like, I would love to hear that with like a gospel choir or something mm. someday. Yeah, you know, I would, uh, I would love it. I just think it's, uh, it's a beautiful song. Let's play them both. Two, two tracks here from Tom Flannery and Brett Alexander. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Good times, bad for some. So long as that's true. Gonna be a struggle. Working alongside you Someone falls, they're left there Like stairs to be climbed Seems we're not much closer To leaving this all behind Got to be the change That you want in this world Got to be the change That you want in this world Got to be the change That you want in this world Got to be the change that you want in this world Patience ain't a virtue When children go to bed With nothing in their bellies And numbers on their heads Ain't nothing trickle down With these fences in Sins of the Father Remember where we've been Got to be the change That you want in this world Got to be the change that you want in this world. Got to be the change that you want in this world. Got to be the change that you want in this world. Gonna leave right now. Who's gonna come with me? Set yourself a moving and set your brother free. Gonna leave right now. Come with me, set yourself a moving, and set your brother free. So as the river 
river flows on backs to the sea open up your eyes so you too may see the stars you have to cross in order to touch the sky for all men born so too must I got to be the change that you want in this world got to be the change that you want in this world got to be the change that you want in this world got to be the change that you want in this world I'm gonna leave right now who's gonna come with me set yourself a moving and set your brother free I'm gonna leave right now who's gonna come with me Set yourself a moving and set your brother free. Got to be the change that you want in this world. Got to be the change that you want in this world. Got to be the change that you want in this world. Got to be the change that you want in this world. I feel like an orphan train Getting down the track With only the discarded Lying on my back Meet me at the station I've got a tale to tell It may not make much difference But I sure do tell it well and I feel like an orphan dream Yes, I feel like an orphan dream I feel like an orphan dream When nobody has me No whole town turns out To watch the kids go by Hear the crying in the night time See the eyes in the day I'll take you somewhere better If someone will lead the way And I feel like an orphan tree Yes, I feel like an orphan tree Load me up with children Load me up with coal Open up my windows and watch me grow Cause I feel like an orphan train A witness to the crime Where grown-ups do the deed and children to the time I wish I could blow a whistle That everyone could hear And this track would lead us somewhere Where God's will is clear Cause I feel like an orphan dream Yes, I feel like an orphan dream.
You load me up with children, load me up with coal. Open up my windows and watch me grow. Cause I feel like an orphan train headed down the track with only the discarded lying on my back. Yes, I feel like an orphan train. Yes, I feel like an orphan dream. Yes, I feel like an orphan dream. Tom Flannery and Brett Alexander with a song called I Feel Like an Orphan Train. And before that, Tom and Brett with a song called Got to Be the Change. We're hanging out with Brett here for the whole hour. We're playing music from his solo material, we're playing some stuff from his time with the Badleys, we're playing some stuff from records that he did with, with Tom, um, Tom Flannery, of course, and with Jeff Lehman. Uh, we played some stuff from Gentleman East, um, another great record that Brett did about 15 years ago was the Cellar Birds record. We probably could have thrown one of those great tunes on here tonight if we had time, Brett. Mm-hmm. Um, all this stuff done at Saturation Acres Recording Studio, yeah. your studio, um, you know, one of the best facilities in Pennsylvania, as far as I'm concerned. I mean, it's such a great sound there and what you do, not only sound-wise, but as a producer. How's things going down there for you now? I mean, uh, you, you've still got a lot of sessions. You've been busy, right? Yeah, it's it's kind of the same. You know, at this point, it's the same every year. I always have about a dozen projects lined up that I'm working on kind of simultaneously. Uh, I'm, do, I'm doing another project with Jeff right now, an, an, a smaller EP project. Oh, okay. A smaller, you know, just a like a five songer. The follow up. And uh, and I'm I'm working on. I got a few tracks cut for uh, a solo record. For you. For me. Oh, okay. Well, there's and, some news. Uh, and uh, is Grace's downfall in? I think I saw that on Facebook. Just, just getting started. Yep. Just getting started on like another EP with those guys. Okay. And um. Joe Whatever. Segan just gave us a song. Joe Segan, yes. <laughs> yeah, he just gave us a song. We just premiered that about two weeks ago. I think we played a couple songs that he had done. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so um, so all these great people coming in. Eddie Abnell? Eddie on? Abnell, that's in transit. Yeah. And that's, that'll that'll be a little while, yeah. Yeah, I've heard he's working with the guys from Three Imaginary Boys yeah, on his record. Tim and yep, those guys are playing with him. Brothers, so mm-hmm. terrific stuff. Well, we wish you all the best with that, man. I mean, Thanks. anytime we get something here that came from there... We're putting it on the air, and I didn't mean for that to rhyme. <laughs> <laughs> Doctor Seuss. <then. laughs> yeah. Let's let's play uh, let's play another one from uh, from Brett and Jeff. This one's called "Do You Want to Feel That Way Again." Things change. It's 
Try to keep your eye on the ball You stop worrying about how to reach the top you Stop worrying about how not to fall Then we close our windows and lock our doors Save our pennies and hedge our bets Quit wondering what's down that yellow brick road Try and protect what we have now. Don't you wanna feel that way again? Driving down that golden avenue. Don't you? Step outside and see how that goes. No, I propose you take my hand, take my hand. Don't you wanna feel that way again? Alexander and Jeff Lehman here on Music on the Menu on the River, a song called Do You Want to Feel That Way Again? Hanging out with Brett here for the whole hour we were, having a great time talking about so many of the projects that he's been involved with, um, and of course, not only as a musician, but um, at Saturation Acres. You're also busy, Brett. You told me you're playing two, 250 shows a year? Mm-hmm. Probably going to do about Between the about band 260. and the soul, 260 shows a year. This year. This year. Yeah. Oh, and we still got we still got six weeks left or so. Yeah. Yeah. So. Well, I, that's projections yeah. not that, based on what I, I don't know if I'm going to be adding that many more. Yeah, well, well you know, yeah. so all this stuff that we talked about on the show, though, Brett's live shows, follow him on Facebook. He's real good at posting his shows for the week. He does a great blog from time to time uh, where he, he writes about his thoughts on music and, and the mm-hmm. music business. And, of course, any of the music that we played tonight, you can find on the website, which is uh, brettalexanderonline.com. And that's Brett with one T. That's so it. BrettAlexanderOnline.com. So if you're interested in the record he did with Tom Flannery or with Jeff Lehman or the Gentleman East stuff or the Celebrate stuff or the solo record, the Gentleman East album, it's all there for you to mm-hmm. you know, find links to and download and purchase it. So. That's it. All right, buddy. Thanks for coming in. It was great to see you. Thanks, thanks for, for me. thanks for bringing in all this great music, man. We really appreciate it. You, oh, you, no you fuel the Thank program, you. man. You really do. <laughs> thanks all right. very much for playing it. We'll leave you with another one from uh, Jeff and Brad. This one's called "Along the Way." We'll catch you next week. Wake up feeling restless every day Cause I don't know where I'm going Along the way I've been following my heart Come what may But I don't know where I'm going Along the way Along the way Along the way My God 
Nobody an angel come my fall But never once tried to spare me from it all She said I could see you were heading the wrong way But I knew I couldn't stop you Someday, and I will be pulling for you. 